morning. Good morning. It's day two of Blogmas. Blogmas. And first of all, thank you so much to everyone who watched day one. Yeah. And has given Pete so many lovely comments on yes, thank you. the Lego display. I appreciate everything that's sort of every opinion, every bit of feedback helps. Yes, um, um, I still haven't finished tinkering with it yet, so there might be some more pictures the, coming soon. The Lego soon. display, if you're new to us, um, Pete is obviously a Lego collector. And the display started about three years ago, I want to say, with just one little table. And yep. every year it's getting bigger and bigger and bigger. I said one year, when people are allowed to visit people, he should do one for charity and people come around and, and donate. So it's definitely something to think about. Yeah, one of our friends, Michaela, said, where's the monorail? So I've got a Disney monorail. It's not Lego. Um, yeah, she was uh, a bit upset. It wasn't Yeah, it, sorry, so, Michaela. So I'll see what <laughs> I can do about that. I might have a think. So we've got some Christmas treats coming up today to we taste. Have. Taste testing today. Yep, bit of taste testing. Calendars. The joke. It's not a joke. It's a Pete's Christmas cracker. Is it, though? We all know you love them. Well, I do anyway. <laughs> but first, we've got to go and earn yes. our treats. So we're going to polish our halos. I'm going to do a Joe Wicks workout. And I'm going to go on the cross trainer. Yawn. Then it's got to be done. Here we go then, day two. Percy Pigmas. Now I've got fun with the two is. This is always the challenge, isn't it? Uh, bear with everyone. We haven't prepped for this, obviously. No, seriously, where is number two? <laughs> Five, 24, 20. Pip needs a number two. <laughs> I do need a number two. Where's my number two? Two, nine, two. There we go. Oh, it's right by the one. Seriously. Well, that was hard work. That was hard work. I've got a... Oh, it's a Christmas card and it says, Love Percy. Yeah. We do love Percy. Early morning chocolate, my love. Oh, I might save it for in a minute because I've just brushed my teeth so I'll oh, get yeah. that minty flavour. Which is... Which It'd be like an after eight, wouldn't it? Ooh, Not this time in the morning. After 8am, I suppose. What you got? And it's Percy. It looks like he's skating. Doesn't really come out. It's like a spider. It's anyway. not a spider. It's definitely Percy skating. Right. I am going to have him in a minute with a cup of coffee. After Joe. Right. Your Next. turn. Yes. Star Wars. Will it be a mini This thing? is quite good. I was impressed with that. Oh, right. now you've got to find your number two now. I need a number two. Snarf, snarf. Do, 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 do. There it is. Can you meddle there? Yes, love a minifigure oh, in a Christmas jumper. Is that any particular character? Yeah, I think that's Poe Dameron. Oh, is it? Oh, okay. Yeah. There he is. Whoop, whoop. And he's got his own little Christmas mug. So oh. I'll build him later and I'll show him to you. When you're on a foreign planet that doesn't know about Christianity, you need a Christmas mug. Overlook that. Okay, fine. That. It's Christmas. Yeah. Who cares? Post workout. Oh. Yes. We are hot. And sweaty, but I need a coffee. So these are the three uh, seasonal ones I've got. So I've got a Starbucks ground coffee to use in the machine. Cool. Not use this one, but I, I'm convinced this is the one my friend Sharon in the States swears by. Um, got a gingerbread latte tin. Which this might be the one I plump for right now. And then I might have one of these later. Love the beanies uh, flavour coffees. Sugar free and pretty much calorie free. But this is the one I'm going for and it says I've got to put in five to six teaspoons of powder. Army. And it's 90% sugar. Yeah, first ingredient, sugar. This is why I don't have these very often. So um, I, I haven't put in five to six, I've put in four. So let's see. But it's all about the gingerbread. Okay, Mrs. B, what's the verdict? Right, taste test time. So this is Sainsbury's gingerbread latte. It's a gingerbread latte. Well, <laughs> yeah, does, it does exactly what it says on the tin. Literally. That was four teaspoons of the powder. I think, and that, that seems quite nice. I think if you put five or six in, 
mega sickly. So yeah, I'd recommend four if you have that too. So Pip, here's one for you. Go on then. I went to the doctors again the other day. I told him, doctor, I'm addicted to Twitter. What did he say? He said, I'm sorry, I don't follow you. <laughs> Where are you going, Pip? Where are you going? And today's wax melt of choice is, because the cupcake one from Asda was rubbish, to be fair, um, is Snow Fairy from Scent Sorcerer on Etsy. And it smells lovely. In your Winnie the Pooh In one. In my Winnie the Pooh melter. We've exercised, we've showered, we're clean. Yep. Right, so, um, oh, and this, this jumper today, this is a, a really vintage Primark one from, gosh, four years ago, I think. Um, is obviously from Ears Ever After. And my lovely Christmas scrunchie oh, yeah. is from Reeves Family Crafted. So I'll leave a link for their shop down below. Nice. Uh, right, so this is, all right, I've got the Inspired by Magic Christmas box. Nice. Um, the lovely Kelly runs it. I don't normally order stationery, but I ordered a print from her in the summer for a friend's birthday, and it was beautiful. I was blown away with the quality. So I thought, let's give this a go. So this was £22. I don't even know what's in it. It's, she's even wrapped it. It came wrapped, so if you wanted to give it as a gift, nice. you're good to go. So really this, good. this is really exciting. Let's open that. I get a close-up of that. How beautiful is that packaging? That is inspiring, isn't it? That is gorgeous. Okay. A magic of the the magic of a cozy Christmas awaits inside. Oh, I've got little sparkly stars. Oh, it's one of those ones you almost don't want to open because it's so pretty. Let's pop that over there. Instagram photos have been taken. <laughs> so. That is Come that on, what's has inside? Been packaged with so much care and love, hasn't it? Right, what have we got inside? Are you ready for this, Mr. B? Right. Ooh. Wow, I'm coming round this way. So we've got oh hot chocolate. Some hot chocolate. She said there was extra little gifts in there. Oh, I've got a bookmark. Well, that's pretty. Got to get a close up of the. Oh, Mickey. She's a stationery shop. If you haven't already uh, guessed, we've got a candy cane. It looks like there's some stickers in there. Nice. Oh, a scratch card. Reveal your tree. Oh my goodness. Oh, I've got a pad. To do list. That looks amazing. We've got a card. Oh, a Christmas card. How beautiful is that? Lovely. Now, this is, what does it say? Let's do that. Believe in the magic of Christmas. <laughs> That's very cute. Oh, and then we've got a, oh, a print of the same one. That's really nice. So I can find a frame for that. Oh, that's so pretty. Oh, my goodness. That print is insane. <laughs> she said they were all exclusive. You can't actually get these in her shop. I need a frame for that immediately. That is gorgeous. So what have we got? We've got a print, we've got a small print, we've got a pad, we've got a card, we've got some treats, we've got a bookmark. Okay, what's in here? Oh my goodness, for 22 pounds, this is really good, Kelly. This is amazing. What's this? Oh, I've got a pin. It's the gingerbread pin. It's the gingerbread Mickey pin. Oh, not focused. Really cute. People, get on over to Kelly's shop, Inspired by Magic. Wow, I love that. I'm not a pin person, but if it's got Mickey and gingerbread on it, I'm all over that. Right, what's in this one? Oh, it's a little hangy decoration. So we've got oh. a hangy. That not fresh. Shall I put it down? It's quite easy dark. To to focus it on there. Oh yeah, that's good. Sparkly. Oh, and it looks like we've got some stickers. 
Who doesn't love stickers? Yes, we've got some stickers. Oh, let's pop them there. Oh, they're cute as well. They're really cute. And I've got a scratch card. So I'm wondering if this is sort of a, a future discount in her shop. Should we find out? So the scratch card can't reveal this because it's a secret to the person who opens the box or who has the box. So it's a, a, a discount code to use in her shop. So that's very kind. Thank you very much, Kelly. I am absolutely blown away with how much is in this box yeah. for £22. That is absolutely fantastic. Look at all that. She did do a princess box a couple of months ago, so I'm sure she's going to do other boxes. So keep your eyes peeled and give her a like on Instagram so you don't miss out. Taste test time. Yes, taste test. Because it's lunchtime now. So, right, what, what do we get? What do you want to go for? Do you want to try your... Oh, okay, mine's um, savoury. So I've got the Sainsbury's Christmas edition. Pigs in blankets noodles. Interesting. They also did a mayo, but um, I don't know. What, what mayo maize? Yes, of pigs in blankets flavour. I'm essentially thinking this is going to be sausage and bacon flavour. So, here we go. Tastes, tastes, like a, today. tastes like a pot noodle. Does it? Yeah. Well, it's noodles, it's a bit, isn't it? Just a little bit. You try. I'm not overwhelmed, let's put it that way. Just tastes like noodles, doesn't it? Yeah, noodles in gravy. Slight hint of sage and onion, what do you think? Yeah, yeah maybe. More stuffing flavour. Actually, is it more of a stuffing flavour? Yeah. Mm. Yeah, we go on. So if you like stuffing, sage and onion stuffing, I think that's... It's all right. right. I will eat it. Yeah, not bad. I won't buy another one. Should we say that? <laughs> so next, inspired. Right, I will finish that, clearly. By right. Mr. David and Mr. Ian. Um, the Bailey's... Uh, Bailey's biscuits. Those ones? What are they called? Leibniz. 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 You used to only ever be able to get these on the continent, didn't you? But now you can get them everywhere. And these are the Bailey's so, edition. Oh, they've got, oh, some, they've got some, some goo in them. I didn't know that. Okay. Oh, I didn't expect them to be so crunchy. Oh, they're good. They're hideous, aren't they? Oh, yeah, that comes through. Mmm. Oh, nice. I like that. Nice rich chocolate as well. Mmm. Actually, I don't recommend them. Don't buy them. Leave them all for us, please. Oh yeah, go and get them. Yeah, they are really good. Mm. Yeah, yeah, that's a, that's thumbs, a up. thumbs up, definitely. Mm. Yeah. I like think you that. pretty much agree with everyone else. Yeah, they're good. That's so finally what I've got. Something not for me. I've never had stolen before, and this is marzipan stolen. So he picked up that. Where did we get that from, Mala? Tesco. Oh, just good old Auntie Tesco. Yep, I'm not keen on things with bits in yeah. like raisins and currants and stuff so this is but all i, I love marzipan so you do don't you and you've never so, had stolen you before quite dry it looks quite dry actually need a cup of tea with it or a, or a glass of mulled wine what are we thinking do you prefer christmas cake do you know what i'm getting dry right white Christmas cake but <laughs> not that rich dark fruity thing you get from a fruit cake oh what from a traditional like English and Christmas that's a marzipan cake. everyone you, what, knows what marzipan tastes are like are you wondering they? where it is apparently it's an authentic German recipe with juicy raisins citrus peel and a delicious marzipan centre where was the centre I think no. that was that orange bit in the can't taste oh. it so so that's a meh is that a meh Average at best, but edible. Okay, so the winner on today's taste test, I think, yeah. was definitely Both. the Bailey's. Bailey's biscuits. I'm going to have a bit more. And I'm going to get another pack when I can find some. So, excellent. And in other news, I'm getting a haircut this afternoon. Hooray! Because we're out of lockdown and in tier two here in Sussex, which means I can finally get it chopped a bit and trimmed up.
So that's it for another Vlogmas Day. Thank you so much for watching. Yes. Please subscribe, give us a like, drop us a comment. Have you tried any of those foods that we've tried? What was your opinion? Mm. Always interesting to know. Yes, thank you for watching. Yes. And don't forget, this isn't just any Vlogmas. It's a Broadway's Away Vlogmas. Cheers. Thank you.